Dear students, let me discuss about what is the meaning of electric dipole. Electric dipole is nothing but a positive charge plus Q and a negative charge minus Q are having certain finite distance between them. And that distance is taken from here to here as L and from here to here as L here. And you know that electric dipole is given by letter small p here. And the definition is electric dipole is any one of the charges and distance between them. It is a product of any one of the charges and distance between them. It is said to be the electric dipole. Therefore, we can write this as 2QL, that's it. And the best example for electric dipole is HCl molecule, which is having partially positive charge. My students, let me discuss about torque acting on electric dipole, which is very important, having many previous year questions in that. So this is an electric dipole having positive charge and negative charge having certain finite distance 2L which is placed in an electric field having positive charge and negative charge that side. So in an electric dipole positive charge is attracted towards the negative charge and negative charge is attracted towards the positive charge by the force called as F is equal to Q into E this side and here also F is equal to Q into E this side also that's why it is called as torque okay. So which will turn the electric dipole and align it along the direction of an electric field. Even though you keep electric dipole like this, after some time it gets aligned along the electric field. So here, what is the torque? You all know torque is nothing but force into perpendicular distance. In this case, torque tau is equal to force into what is the perpendicular distance between these two is taken as BC here. This is B and C, this is BC. So therefore, which is taken as BC here. And you should know one more thing that if you consider sine theta here, what are you going to get now? If you consider sine theta is going to be opposite side BC and hypotenuse which is taken as 2L, therefore BC is nothing but 2L sine theta, okay, 2L sine theta. Here therefore the torque tau is equal to F into BC, F is nothing but Q into E and uh, which can also be considered as BC is nothing but 2L sine theta, okay. Therefore torque tau can be considered as Q into 2L, let me take to one side, Q into 2L will take it to one side, E to other side, therefore they take it as sine theta here, therefore you all know it's a Q into 2L is nothing but it is going to be electric dipole which is given by letter small p and this is nothing but PE sin theta. That's it. Okay. So torque acting on electric dipole is nothing but dipole moment into electric field into sin theta that is taken as an angle here. That's it. Thank you very much. Have a nice day. Dear students, till now there are two questions asked about torque acting on electric dipole. So here this is a positive charge and negative charge and they are same and it is given here and it is kept in an electric field. 2 into 10 power, 2, 2 into 10 power, 5 newtons per coulomb. And the distance between the two charges is always taken as 2L and directly 2L is given as 3 centimeters, which is 3 into 10 power minus 2 meters. And you know that torque acting electric dipole formula is this one. And here dipole as well as electric field, they are perpendicular to each other like this, okay? Making 90 degrees. So therefore, sine 90 is going to be 1. You know that electric dipole is Q, charge into distance between the two charges. That's it. Therefore, torque is equal to 2 into 10 power minus 6. 2L is 3 into 10 power minus 2. E is how much? 2 into 10 power 5. So finally, 2 to 6 to the 12. 12 into 10 power minus 3 Newton meter is going to be our answer. That's it. Now, the another model which was asked in torque is uh, this one. The positive charge and negative charge is given. The distance of two charges is given as 2 into 10 power minus 2 because it is given as 2 centimeters. Okay, and even torque is also given here, that is 4 Newton meter. And the angle between electric field as well as dipole, I mean, it is given as 30 degrees here. You all know torque is nothing but P sin theta, P is nothing but electric dipole, which is 2L into Q E sin theta, that is sin 30 degrees. Same formula I am using here, I am finding what is the charge in this case. He is asking us to find out what is the charge. Therefore, charge is nothing but Torque divided by 2L into E sin 30 is nothing but 1. If you observe what is the torque here? 4 and 2L is given as 2 into 10 power minus 2 and E is also given here. What is E? E is given as 2 into 10 power 5 into half. Okay. So the finally charge will be how much? Nearly 2 milli coulombs charge will be getting. That is D option. That's it.